these data demonstrate that you can have a very high LDL and APOB on a ketogenic diet and remain at low overall risk of plaque progression. And we kind of hit, I, I wrote some notes, we kind of hit on this. The people in the blue zones, on average, their cholesterol was over 250, but they typically eat some form of a Mediterranean or lots of seafood diet. And actually most of the long lived individuals to Jessica's point is they have a greater than 200 cholesterol. Well, and if you follow a bunch of people, they'll tell you that you need cholesterol greater than 200 or you're not capable of building the brain and the hormones and things like that. It's, it's the, it, but you have to follow a, a good fat diet to have that cholesterol. You don't want a cholesterol that's super high because you're eating french fries and cheeseburgers.